Hi viewers, welcome back to VGDR Literature, English exclusively. Today we are going to look into Shakespeare. Shakespeare is the greatest English dramatist. He was born in Stratford. He had no university education. But at the age of 19, he got married. His wife was eight years senior to him. He came out of his home to London. He became an actor. Later, he became one of the leading dramatists of his time. He spent around 20 years in London and died in the year 1616. In the 20 years, he has produced poems and plays. Shakespeare's works are classified under two categories, non-dramatic poems and dramatic works. Non-dramatic poetry consists of two narrative poems, Venus and Adonis, The Rave of Lucrece, and 154 sonnets. The first 126 sonnets are addressed to a man named W.H. The remaining 28 sonnets are addressed to a woman named Dark Lady. Shakespeare's dramatic period covers uh, 24 years. Critics divide these 24 years into four periods. The first period is between 1588 to 1593. It is an early period. The plays written in this period are Henry VI, Titanus, Aronicus, Love's Labour Lost, Two Gentlemen of Verona, The Comedy of Errors, A Midsummer's Night Dream, and Richard III. All these plays show signs of immaturity. There is no depth of thought in theme. In the second period, which covers from 1594 to 1600. During this period, Shakespeare has written great comedies and chronicles, history plays. The Merchant of Venice, Much Ado About Nothing, The Taming of the Screw, The Merry Wives of Windsor, As You Like It, Twelfth Night, are his romantic comedies. Richard II, King John, Henry the Fourth, Part One, Part Two, Henry the Fifth, or the historical plays. In all these plays, there is depth in thought and theme and powerful characterization. Third period, which starts from 1601 and ends in 1608. In this period, Shakespeare has written the greatest tragedies and dark comedies, which are problem plays. Hamlet, Othello, King Leo, Macbeth are Shakespeare's greatest tragedies. Two great Roman tragedies also come under this period. They are Julius Caesar and Antony and Cleopatra. The third period covers from 1601 to 8 are comes under dark comedies. The plays written in this period are called dark comedies. Measure for Measure, Trailers and Crusade, All's Well That Ends Well, and Timon of Athens. The plays written during this period show high poetic expression. There is depth of thought and powerful characterization. The comedies in this period are called dark comedies as the tone of the comedies are evil. And the last period from 1608 to 1612. It includes the last plays of Shakespeare. They are called romances. The romances of this period are Cymbeline, The Tempest, The Winter's Tale, Priscilla's, and Henry the Eight, which is an incomplete play. They were completed by Shakespeare's junior contemporary Fletcher. 
the place of the fourth period show good conquering evil reconciliation pardon and reunion as a theme of the play thank you for watching the video if you like please subscribe if you have any comment please place on the comment box thank you